There are many issues uh, here, uh, issues both at the end of Iran as well as uh, in Central Asia itself. Uh, the developments in Afghanistan, which automatically affected uh, Chabahar. And of course, uh, our own hesitation in, in going ahead in a big way with Chabahar, given the, the, the fact that the Americans have sanctions on uh, Iran. And uh, that affects many several Indian companies. So we have to keep looking over our shoulder at the US to, to see, see that it doesn't uh, uh, you know, affect any companies. So all these factors have have kept this uh, uh, project as a, as a jinxed project, uh, despite uh, some element of good wishes on both sides, both Iran and India, and perhaps also in the Central Asian countries, it has not really made much headway. Mm -hmm. Is it, um, would you say the area around where Chahabar is located uh, is there an issue there? It's, um, you know, uh, Balochistan is there, Sistan Balochistan, uh, which is an area that is uh, problematic for Iran in many ways. Yes, that's what I meant when I said that there are uh, internal issues in Iran which uh, affect the development of Chabahar port. Uh, Chabahar is in this uh, eastern province of Iran. It's called Sistan Balochistan. So it's essentially the people are Baloch, they're not Iranians and they are Sunnis, uh, they have issues with, well, they, they often help the Baloch people in Pakistan, which means that the border between Pakistan's Balochistan province and Sistan Balochistan uh, is a tense border. Uh, there are these uh, groups, uh, freedom fighters in, in Balochistan who are based in Sistan Balochistan. And then there are people from Balochistan, Balochistan, who take shelter in Balochistan because the Iranians are pursuing them. So this region is disturbed for both Iran and for Pakistan. And uh, that makes uh, Iran look at Sistan, Balochistan more as, as a province of trouble where it has to maintain law and order and maintain a strict control than as a province to develop into uh, a major uh, area for allowing its own development and transit across to Afghanistan and Central Asia. So that hesitation has, has always been at the back of Iran's minds. And uh, while Iran is OK with the port coming up, it is the connectivity, the what's called the uh, International North-South uh, Trade Corridor, the INSTC, mm -hmm. uh, which needs to be developed before Chabahar port, uh, for Chabahar port to become uh, an important uh, anthropod uh, for Central Asia. And if you would have noticed, uh, our foreign minister had gone to Russia shortly yeah. before he went to Iran. And in this INSTC, the INSTC, yeah, the uh, North-South uh, Corridor, uh, Russia and India and Iran, all three are, are, are engaged and all three are trying to promote that. So, uh, yes, there is, there is that issue of Sistan Balochistan's uh, ethnicity uh, that affects the development of Chabahar port.